Good morning. Today I want to show you this project that we're doing here in the plant. I have this oversized canvas that I want to frame in a canvas float frame, but because of its size and because I am personally not very proficient with a drill, I want to have the plant actually do the framing for me. So we're going to go back there and see how the professionals do it. The first step is to get this placed properly within the frame. Part of the process is figuring out how the painting needs to be placed within the float frame to keep the spacing even. So here in the plant, we are using strips of foam core to help us make sure that the, the canvas is placed within the frame so that all the spacing around the canvas is even. Yeah, see what I love about this style of framing treatment is it literally makes the piece float within the frame. What I just learned is that the type of screw that you use for framing with a float frame is really important and the type of canvas that you're working with may dictate the type of screw that you can use. Um, for this particular piece, it was um, difficult to use our standard screw because it is an oil on linen. It's very thick. Um, the stretcher bar itself is about an inch thick, an inch deep. And the original screw we tried wasn't thick enough. So now we're using a little thinner screw with a flat head and they seem to be having better luck with that. So anytime you order a float frame from us, it is pre-drilled in the back and evenly spaced. So it makes it simpler. Holly is going to wire this all the way around since it's an oversized piece so that the weight is distributed um, evenly and that the bottom corners don't take too much uh, stress. So notice we are not putting any kind of paper backing on the back, especially with an original oil. Um, the canvas needs to breathe, otherwise it'll get moldy. So using the same screws, Holly will be drilling in the um, hanging mechanism for the wire hangers, kind of in from the edge of the frame so that it won't show, so the, so the screw won't show within the float. So this will be in here for good. <laughs> It'll be very difficult to remove this from the frame. But truly the frame becomes part of the art. It cannot be considered really a separate thing. Yeah, right there, you're good. So I'm actually gonna help. <laughs> Got it. So if you're doing this at home, you would just twist the bottom wire real securely. Shall we take this down and show the finished product? Wow. <laughs> Gorgeous. So when you frame your artwork with American Frame, you can either make this completely a do-it-yourself project, or you can bring your work to our plant if you happen to be living in the area or close by or coming through and we'll do it for you, we'll frame it for you. So whichever way, it's either a do-it-yourself project or a do-it-with-us project. I love this, this is beautiful. <laughs>